Hey guys, hope you're doing okay today. We have got a lot going on. We are in a battle trying to get into qualify Europa qualifying uh, in the league. We have an FA Cup quarterfinal today, so we are pushing to try to be competitive for some silverware. <sighs> and we've got some injuries, but that doesn't matter. You can't blame anything on injuries, as Liverpool knows so well this year. Of course, all the Premier League sides are blaming injuries, but Leeds United never gets the benefit of having any injuries. Just burnout. But anyway, let's get into it. Hey guys, RC here with Football Manager 21. This is our journeyman save. We're at Club 3. This is episode 23. Remember, if you like what I'm doing, please hit the like button on the videos, trying to help uh, beat the YouTube algorithm, get more eyes on the videos. Thank you very much for doing that. And uh, subscribe if you haven't done it yet. And uh, hey, whatever you can do to pass word about the channel, I would be greatly indebted. Let's get into it. You can see uh, since the loss to Man United last episode, we beat Rotherham 3-1. Noel Mark with a brace. Eric Graves with a goal as well in that one. We also beat Everton 1-0. Noel Mark scoring his 20th goal of the season. Eric Graves is on. Oh, that's not. That's the minute. Duh. Uh, but yeah, he did hit a milestone because he got some extra cash for that. Uh, Eric Graves also doing well. So a couple of league wins. We're going to be playing Newcastle today. Uh, just the one episode. We may do a highlight for Brentford after that, or we may come back and do a double FA Cup episode if we get to the semis. We'll see. Uh, taking a look at the league, you can see we're currently in ninth position, 48 points. We are only two points behind Rotherham, and we have a better goal differential than both clubs in front of us. So we've got a shot here. Now, we do have Newcastle right behind us, but we've got a pretty good gap, nine points ahead of Liverpool. By the way, Liverpool offered me a job interview. Uh, I turned it down. Uh, Bielsa would not interview for a job in the midseason. Uh, so uh, anyway, <laughs> I passed on it. Taking a look at our top goal scorers, just we talked about it. So 29 goals for Graves, 24 for Mark, and uh, both of them are performing very well. Unfortunately, as you can see, we are a two-man team. Uh, what's that, 53 goals between them? Our next leading scorer is Jamie Romain with six, and he is still out injured. He is out for three more days before he returns to training. So probably a week, week and a half to get back into fitness. And Rui Ramos in the midfield is uh, four goals. But we do have 22 assists between those two guys, so definitely need them. Ramos is back from a small injury. It kept him out for a couple of days. And you can see, look how much we're paying our midfield. That is insane. Uh, a lot of money there. Much more than our strikers. So I'm not anxious for their contracts to come due. Jumping into team selection, we're going to go with Solis and goal, Fowler, Licka, and Hilden on the back three, Wheel and Pascarello on the wings. Romain and Mensa are both out. Hutchinson is going to step in into the midfield. Mateus is going to be in there as well. Ramos moves up to the number 10. Graves and Mark up top. Uh, Hutchinson, you may remember, we haven't seen him very much. He's a 21-year-old player from Man United. He's on loan. Uh, not a bad player, so he's got d some definitive potential. Uh, he's only got 11 appearances for us this year, one assist. Mateus, I really like him, 21-year-old Brazilian, uh, but 19 passing. Really like this guy, but he needs to be doing much better than two assists, and we need to see him up that rating as well if he wants to continue to have a chance in the side. Would love to see the boys do well here. We'd like, I mean, we were only supposed to make it to the fifth round, so we've exceeded that. So we've already exceeded club expectations. Mateus with the interception. Graves finds Mark on the through ball. I'll pass it to Ramos. He was wide open. But Mark takes the crack at it. Oh, man, he could have done better than that. 
All right, we're back with another highlight, building from the back this time. Pascarello finds Mark. Ah, I don't know what the hell that was. That was not good, whatever it was. Please don't do that again. Three shots, and we've only got a .25. Oh, that's Newcastle. Still, Mateus on the ball. We come back with another highlight. Can we do better? Hutchinson through to Pascarello. What a save by Hoppy. Or Hope. Is that Hope or Hop? I'm guessing Hope. Just a guess, though. Oh, my God, and Licka misses the header. And Ronald Luis scores his 23rd. That was horrible. That was horrible. Horrible. And deplorable. All right, let's go take a look here real quick. What's his, what's his heading ability? 11 heading, 14 jumping reach. He's six feet tall. We're going to do that. Oh, my goodness. That was horrific. you got to have better from your cover man there. Louise bottling up four players. All right, Ramos. Good control. Wheel cuts it inside. Into the box. Mark runs it down. Oh, my God. How did they not score that? Another big save from their keeper. That one's cleared out off the corner. They've got a counter opportunity here, but we do have two men back, Hilden and Mateus. And thankfully that shot goes wide. Let's encourage. We've got the advantage on shots, on target, dominating possession, but just not much in the way of real chances. Licka gets beaten. Solis cuts the angle and makes that save, thankfully. I'm going to feel a little done in. They've had a good run here to, to make up shots. Here's a question for you guys I was always wondering. So if you're watching this in England, all the stadiums are open. Now, you know, like right here, you can see they have the, the seating areas mostly covered, right? Why don't they just make enclosed stadiums with a roof on it? Because uh, that's a common thing here in the States. Most of our stadiums, uh, not baseball particularly, but um, especially when you're dealing with weather. And I know in England, you know, I see the rain and, you know, the 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 freezing and the snow. You know, why wouldn't you just put a uh, a roof on it and not worry about any of that stuff? Just curious. If you have any idea why that would be, let me know in the comments. Oh, there's a through ball blocked away. Mark could not pull the trigger fast enough. All right, let's encourage him here. Oh, my God. Charles Diabati, his ninth of the season. He was just left alone inside the box. I guess when you're playing a three back set, you know, you have to, you know, they got to condense into the middle there just to, you know, be solid. But man, you'd certainly like them to be smart enough to, to drift out a little bit. Oh, another big save. Look at that. I think, you know, 90% of the clubs that would have went in. We are in a two nil hole. Now, I said this was a winnable game. I didn't say we were going to win it. You 
You know, th this was going to be a tough out no matter what happened. Wheel cuts it inside. Nice ball to Graves. He beats his man and again holds back just enough to allow their guy to get a foot in. All right, Pascarello in danger of being booked. Hutchinson, let's bring uh let's bring Rowe on for him. Eh, no. I'm gonna drop Ramos back. Do I have anybody else that can play there? Gomez Santos. Let's do that. Pascarello for Mikeaton. Let's do that. I really wish we had Menza here. I wish we had Romaine. But we don't. That was just a, you know, that was a spray and pray, man. Like shooting a machine gun. Oh, my God. That's the second time they've scored a goal like that, just going across him, and he couldn't make the angle. I don't want to watch that again. Yes, proceed. And we need to demand more. I'm going to go to attacking. All right, here's Mikeaton. He gets it into Mark, who heads it wide. That's the stupidest thing I've ever seen. That's a brace for Ronald Louise. Well, that's the nail in the coffin there, man. 4 nil. We have just fallen apart. I'm going to berate them now. Not happy with this at all. Look at that. Oh, my God. Now he's got a hat trick. Two goals in five minutes. I'm going to drop back to positive because that's really appeared to open us up here. But, I mean, look at that. A deflection, and he just turns his hip and volleys it in. Holy shit. What is the deal? I want to bring uh, Luke Rowe on there. I don't have anybody for wheel. Yeah, let's bring Luke Rowe on. Injuries have hurt us, but, you know, I mean, it, it is what it is. I'm waiting for him to just dribble through all three of these guys and score a fourth, right? Oh, he held his hands up to ask for a penalty. What the hell are y'all doing passing it back in? Don't do that. All right, there's Mikeaton. Tackled away, wheels on it. No, that was horrible. Horrible. Flick on header, Schubert's on to it. I think I'm going to have to have a talk with Solis after this. I mean, he's playing a 6-9, and he's some of those goals just looked really bad. All right, Graves runs on to it. He beats his man, but then he holds it up. Can't beat the defender. He is not known for his passing. Stabbed away. Harvey runs on to it, un uncontested. And he puts one in. Jeez. What is the deal here? I've already made all the say, you know. Sure, why not? I'll let my assistant manager make that call. Just do it. Can't do any worse than we're doing now, right? Wheel charges in. Leaves his area unmarked. Gomez Santos, poor pass into the middle. Oh, there's one. And was he offsides? No. Graves gets the goal. Uh, no, they were looking at it. Hold on. I think they're going to disallow it. No, it's awarded. Yay. <laughs>
Eric Graves with the goal. Noel Mark with the assist. Yeah, Mark wasn't offsides. I thought Graves could have been. But sympathy goal, 6-1. to one. Wow. Really wasn't expecting that. So no silverware. At least not here in the FA Cup. Over the top, nice control by Graves. He holds it up, lays it in. There's Mikatin, and he hits it right at the keeper. Need to do a little bit better with our finishing there, fellas. All right, Rowe picks out wheel. Good chest down. Squared into Mateus. It's tackled away from him. Wheel's on it. Mark, it's Mikatin, and Mikatin scores his third of the season. Mark gets an assist on that, but eh. But two late goals. I guess we'll take some credit there. 13 to 11 on target. XG's pretty close. We didn't have, you know, we only had the one goal that came off, you know, that one set piece that I saw in the highlights. We dominated possession. I, I don't know, man. That's just, I think that's just a bad beatdown. We just got unlucky there. So, yeah, hands together. Unlucky, boys. It would have been nice. Yeah. We made it farther than we were supposed to. So we get de the defeat in the quarterfinal. How much money do we get for that? Anything? We should. Like Aston Villa won on penalties. We do have the international break coming up. We'll have 20 players eventually out on international duty. All right. Well, that was less than I had hoped for. We had been in a pretty good run of form. Man City wasn't a surprise. This was this was a beatdown. So there's no FA Cup to come back for. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of play through the end of the season. We'll see if we can get into contention. Now, we did uh, secure, uh, we, we staved off relegation. It was the, uh, the win against Everton, guaranteed that we would not get relegated. So if we get to a point that we're playing for Europe, we'll come back. Um, otherwise, we'll just come back for the season finale. Uh, we'll have highlights for Leeds and the game against Tranmere. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll be playing for something then anyway. But uh, that, we'll go ahead and play out April. We'll come back uh, in May for the final two matches. And uh, hopefully we're playing for something uh, for next season. Guys, again, hit that like button if you like what I'm doing. Subscribe if you're new. And don't forget, we do have daily content Monday through Saturday. So hit the little notification bell to stay up to date for that. You guys are the greatest. Thanks. Bye.